Well, the Topeka Zoo made a big announcement today regarding the future of its leadership. 13's Alex Carter is in our studio tonight with more on what's in store at the zoo. David, Topeka Zoo Director Brendan Wiley announced he will be leaving the position in November after leading the zoo for the last 13 years. You know, we're standing here at the Topeka Zoo and Conservation Center. There's no place that makes me happier. Um, and it's uh, kind of with bittersweet um, emotions that today I announced my resignation. Brendan Wiley says he has accepted an offer to oversee the Cameron Park Zoo in Waco, Texas. He says it was difficult breaking the news to his staff. Sharing this type of news um, is hard. You know, we've, we've all been in it together. And so it was a little emotional, but um, I wouldn't have it any other way. Wiley has overseen continued expansion since taking over as Topeka Zoo Director in 2010, including popular attractions like the K. McFarland Japanese Garden and the Giraffe and Friends exhibit, and events like Zoo Lights and Brew at the Zoo. The Topeka Zoo in this community is a symbol of pride. It's um, more than just recreation. It's more than just entertainment. It's about being part of a cause, being part of a mission, and it's about bringing people and families together in a place that you can uh, just imagine being in a different world. As he prepares to leave the capital city, Wiley says he's proud of what he's been able to achieve as zoo director, but notes none of it would have been possible without the people around him. It's been great uh, watching and being part of the transition of things that occurred here. And one of the things that I'm most proud of is um, all of those accomplishments were always a group effort. Um, there's not a single thing that I did by myself here. Wiley's last day as Topeka Zoo director will be November 10th, and he says the Topeka Zoo has not yet started the process of searching for his successor. We wish him all the best. Alex, thanks for the update.